The doors start to open as Roxy turns the handle and flees back wildly. Revealing a large fire in the middle of the room that smells of hair and is very humid. Let me reveal. Oh dear. <laughs> Hot pocket. It's the microwave of... Tango carefully walks in on tiptoe. She, she's got a forty-nine. She's got a massive. She's got a massive stealth check. And yeah, and she's invisible. I know. Roxy's gonna stand here. And she's like, okay, this is bestie, and she's gonna whip out her scroll of see and invisibility. Right, qu Quadrille comes up. I'm yep. at twenty-six right now, stealthing. By the way. Okay. Oh, and but, another handy perception yeah, my check. Scroll, my C scroll of my C invisibility didn't pick up anything. You, okay, so you cast C invisibility? I used my scroll of C invisibility. Yeah. One second. Holy crap, that worked. You're fucking good at this. <laughs> <laughs> All I, right. I understand. It, it was a little suspicious that the evil room was got nothing in it. Alright, my food's done. Just a second. <laughs> okay. He's eating Hot Pockets and shit, man. It's not good. Hot Pockets. Hot Pockets. Yeah. <laughs> Mom! Bathroom! <laughs> Forever tainted oh, Hot Pockets. Good You see, you, all of a sudden you cast the spell from the scroll, see invisibility. And all of a sudden you see a, a large dome um, come to appear that seems to be a, a sphere of some type. And you see a creature in the middle. A live creature? Yes. An angry live creature. It's, it's eyeing you. Fighting like, no. its time. It, it is like demonic, I guess. Is my Roxy, Roxy's like tangled back out of there. There's a giant evil thing in that barrier. It's tangled. Uh, hold on before you move out of there. I need to look up its. I love big invisible monsters. <laughs> like I said, it probably can't even sense tangle. I like them. Um, it, it sniffs in the air. It sniffs in the air, and and seems to locate a creature. And it, its eyes, rocks you see, are directed at Tangle. Tangle, back up. Tangle, back <laughs> up. Can it? Can it? Uh, so it can see Tangle, even though she's no. Invisible? It can't see you, but it, it knows you're you. there. It smells you. Hey Matt, have I ever heard any stories, or am I aware of what this creature might be? Um, With a 24? The notes gave you an idea that it is a a bar guest of some type. Uh, it is a snarling canine quad, beast. Quadrule? I, this is... Roxy pulled out her wand. Uh, I, I think we should... Hey guys, there is a giant but gas in there. All of a sudden... Um, Quadrule's not moving. Quadrule. <laughs> uh, everyone that can see Quadrule, Quadrule instantly disappears. What? Except for um, except for Roxy, who sees invisibil invisibility. It seems that this creature uh, has an invisibility sphere casted around it. And the that would probably creature that. attacks Quadrule. Um, and that wouldn't be for, for Tangle, too, because Tangle was standing in the same qu square as Quadrule, well, if that's you possible. Can't do, you can't do that. You can't really do that, yeah. so just move adjacent oh, well, to, to Tangle. Like, yeah. Well, in that case, then, I was here. Okay. I moved back, but, but well, I... Well, well except you that's... Could, you, could, you move there, except you bump into no, I something. Was, I was here, and then I moved back here, which I can't do. So since I couldn't have done that, then I have to go back to where here, I was. You can move here. Yeah. You can't move there. Not the red one. <laughs> there's a monster I'm just, there. I'm just saying. No, there's not. 
that there's a I thought you just said there was. There's a monster right up. here now. Oh, okay. Okay, well, all right, fine. That's good. Cool. I understand. And a a creature appears. Oh, shit. Now, and it's now actually... That sorry, since... it is actually a large creature. Oh, shit. Well, Quad was not too worried. But, Super you know. cool! So, actually, Quadril does not disappear because the creature is itself 10 feet. So, it's just gotcha. a creature that disappears. So, he just becomes visible then? Is this a reflex save or it's just a full blown attack, flat footed? This is a full blown attack, flat footed. You are fucking surprised. Hey, look, there's this large ass creature. Okay. And Tangle. Um, Go for it. I'm ready to charge. Yeah. How does Bring that. It. Tangle um, what? Except the thing is, you can't really charge as because <laughs> you're blocked, so it's kind of wasted. Yeah, because Quadril. No, no move. Okay. Quadril didn't want to move, so. Well, I wasn't gonna move into the room. It's quite all right, guys. All right. Um, he goes at you with everything he has. He goes at me. No, no, me. Quadril. Okay. Like, We're still invisible. Yeah, he, he, he smells you, Tangle, but he doesn't see you, so he's going with what he can see. All right, this is going to be his bite attack, and then two <laughs> claw attacks. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, he hits me All three right, times. And a, a claw was a critical. Let's see if he confirms. He confirms. Oh, you're going to be uh -oh. hurt. That's plus 14. Um, oh, shit. Serious. I need to look to up. say. Oh, no, he doesn't. I meant have... to say, uh, tangle there. I'm sorry. Yeah, that's cool. Uh, get behind it, like you mean. He... I'm not gonna move, but I'm just wondering if you mean here or here. Uh, I'm thinking behind it. Other way. I would highly so... suggest that you don't do that. Yeah, I'd yeah, say go, like, it has a fourteen where, like, day. where yeah. I am after I move. Well, I can't see tangle right now, so it have to oh, perceive psh. tangle. If I'm still alive, I'm jumping right over his ass, so it's it'll be fine in that regard. All right. You can't so, flank a large creature. I, I, I got to put on the breastplate. <laughs> yeah, you can flank a large creature. Okay. Um. So you take ten. Oh no. Nineteen damage. Oh. Plus. Oh wait, no. Sorry, forget. He hit Just you 10. three times. Ten damage. Okay. Sorry. Okay. Plus, yeah. I'm supposed to roll D6 for the claws. How much HP do you have total? 31. So, 18 damage. Okay, wow. so I just did 10, so now I'm down more. Okay. Well, uh, so, 18 damage so far to you, Zach. Yep. Plus, here it comes the critical. 17 more damage. Wow, that sucks. I'm uh, negative 5. Okay. Oh. Holy crap. And uh, the, the creature appears to you and lets out a large roar. Roar! Proxy, Proxy, whispers to Tangle. So, everyone roll initiative. Would my charge in the act now, being that he's not <laughs> Yeah, you can. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> okay, can I do that? Yeah, I'm going to do that. Um, question, uh, how long does Tangle stay invisible? How long does that last? You have five minutes, but that's 30 rounds. You're invisible. Unless you attack. Also, if you, if you attack him, your invisibility drops. But you get sneak attack for the if you hit the first while you're invisible. So. All right, so initiative. Twenty three is my charge attack. Twenty three, yeah, is a hit. Nice. And I raise. Oh shit! I gotta there. change that. Oh no, the page is slow for some reason. Kevin, you're picking up on roll twenty pretty good. It's not that hard. Yeah, it's uh, it's pretty similar to map tools. So. Yeah. Twelve plus ten. This one D six. Oh. Thirteen damage. Rock and combat music. And I have a plus eight to initiative now. Thirteen damage? Yeah. Alright. Two of that was lightning or electric or whatever. Okay. 
check. Oh, is is that an outsider? Uh, or, uh, what is it? The uh, aberration. Aberration. That's what and your your weapon is magic, correct? Yeah, it is. So, yeah. all right. Yeah, was it an apparition or a magical beast? Um, it is neither of those. It Damn, is okay. evil, extra planar, lawful, shape changer. Shape changer. It is a large cool. outsider. <laughs> I like all of this except quadril being down. Working on it. Nice. Oops, wrong one. Nineteen plus six is twenty-five. I, I don't like that. They can un re roll with the positive. And... Did everyone enter their initiative? Mm -hmm. Yep. Yes, yeah. I did. So it goes. And. Um, it's gonna hurt let me, me look up scent. No, actually, never mind. Uh, if you were... Isn't there a big barbarian? Yeah, there is. Big... Sorry, he's hidden behind um, Zach. Let me just move Zach off to the side and move Muka to the front. There we go. Hey. Um, so, full round attack on you. My AC is like, shit. You get plus one because it's low. Oh, 31. Of course that hits, dude. 15 and 33. Hey. Yes. 15, 15 does not hit. A natural one always yeah. hits. Um, okay. So. That, that's a fumble. He probably loses the rest of his attacks because he, no, he swung so we don't, we're not. We don't do fumbles. <laughs> we tell uh, I brought it up to the group one time, but yeah. they did not want to do that. So, what? hey, um, I was I was thinking about doing the the critical hit and critical fumble deck, but they decided yeah, it'd be too risky. So yeah, and yeah, just... I mean, I rolled in, I rolled a couple natural ones with Roxy. I mean, I, I would hate for her to take off her right. own so, hand. I think this is Melfesh Nicor. That's my <laughs> guess. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. Like, My this guess is, is this has got to be about fashion decor. <laughs> My fashion decor just raped me. Oh, bring the damage, I'm man. I'm bringing it. I'm Fucking dude, thirty-six damage. God damn it. Twelve plus seven, so nineteen damage to you, Muka. I'm still at thirty-nine. Okay. This is like a scratch. Is, is it my turn? And it's. <sighs> Yes. <laughs> okay, Roxas, fetch the dying monk. Okay. Yep, he does it. He, so he he walks up to Quadrul, one move action, and then drags Quadrul back to here. Okay. I mean, he does have the fetch command, so as for Roxy, she's like <laughs> litter dust, and. She, she makes like a Kamehameha gesture and this glittery, dusty stuff appears right here. Okay. This is the first large creature you guys have fought. Yep. Yep. I've been... oh. Hero points are gonna be flying. Oh. I'm wondering why Nuwali... that would bring down her invisibility because I am technically attacked. I'm wondering why Nuwali was so stupid she couldn't summon Malfesh in the corner. This is an easy... It, you you saw her journal that uh, she has she's known about him but she has did not find a way to get back here so gotcha oh, oh. Cool. not that bright <laughs> <laughs> i'll say <laughs> okay um, so uh glitter dust he needs to make a 16 we'll say will plus 14 he needs to roll like uh, six or better 27, we'll say. No. Dang, dang it. Well, and that, if that's the case, Roxy takes a step back to it. Okay. We'll all get a good look at him. And she, she says, Tangle, get behind Mooka. Just as a suggestion. Um, that's the end of my turn. All right. Mooka. Yeah, I'm going to just... Uh, the, this right. beast eyes. Look, eye your friend behind you, and its mouth starts drooling. Yeah, I'm very upset that he hurt Quadruple. Thanks, buddy. I love you, too. What's that, 13? <laughs> I fucking hate they put a die on the thing. The numbers, I can't read the numbers very well. Yo, you can turn that off if you want, under settings. You go to oh, that's um, cool. turn off, enable advanced dice. You can turn that off. 
Ah, thank you, thank you. All right, roll um, 25. 25 is a hit. All right, and that was an RAP8, so that's plus 16 damage. Fuck you! Quadro whimpers a little bit in cheering. <laughs> 26, all right. It howls in pain and looks you fiercely in, uh, straight in the eyes as this hulking monster looks down on you. Nice. Tangle's a badass. She's just up there. She's, She's just, just like, <laughs> what's up, dog? <laughs> I'm in your face. I'm at the front lines. I'm invisible. Um, She's invisible. Our, she wants to right, get, so, you know, uh, she'll move. <laughs> <laughs> All it's right. Fine. So I can get ready. It's a RD20 plus my const modifier to save, stabilize. Um, It is... One D is a DC ten, but one D twenty plus your negative current hit points. Oh. So one D twenty minus whatever you're at, minus five. Got. Assume in our box of band aids if you get over that. Right. My turn. Well, quadrule needs to roll. Quadru- uh, what is quadrule? He's he's at six. Do you want me to roll right now? You have to. Yeah, I, oh I, wait, no, sorry. I, I thought, did set my. I was wondering why you're asking. Sorry. Uh, so I could walk away and make food. So gotcha. Yeah, that's that's all. Corral. Corral is uh I'm going to move right here and sacrifice the silent spell for a cure moderate wounds. Okay. Twelve back to our monk friend. All right, I'll do that. Him. So Sweet. he's at seven and he comes alive. Like, what? What's going on? <laughs> and um, the creature. Ooh, I need to look up. I forgot about combat and large creatures. Minus two is an AC. Um, Tangle. Yeah, baby. I mean, yes. <laughs> Okay, uh, all right, so metagaming for a moment here, my fellow players. Uh, you know, Tangle's got a nasty, you know, sneak attack that she can do, you know, but like if I moved here, for example, here out of his way, hopefully, and sneak attack, but if he hits her, she's got 19 hit points, so she'll just die basically. That's, that's you can awesome. move here and shoot an arrow over move his head and put it because you took a side shot. Right, and you have I did. To seal or, it or right here's now. another suggestion: you could draw it, you could stab it with one of your weapons here, and then move back to get ready to do smart. Or, I mean, he's only ha- he only has a fifty percent chance of hitting you, even if you um, if she attacks, as it breaks. Like, well, because you're invisible right now, so yeah. So she so okay. If you go inside, what's to stop him from, you know, hopping over? Yeah, hopping over to Tangle and just, so that just seems dumb. But what do you think, Twirl? I mean, uh, Kevin. Well, I mean, uh, life bait. (laughs) Um, (laughs) The the thing is, if he turns onto you there, uh, I mean, what, well, if we're we're metagaming, giving advice, I would probably move to the corner here for a bow shot. Seeing uh, he's his concentration is focused totally up on this hallway. He goes to look at but, you there, and he turns around. Um, you know, we've got some stuff behind him. Are, are you locked in there? Yeah, but he's got an angry barbarian and, uh, you know, et cetera. And then he loses his, any dex bonus because he's going to – he has to basically turn around to face you. Okay. Um, but, so. again, it's – or, you know, you can go up to here and just start taking shots at him. Right, but being she's invisible, doesn't she already get her stealth bonus from just being anywheres and being invisible and shooting her arrow? Yeah, but that drops immediately after she attacks. Okay. So. Great. great uh, now, sneak but, attack is whenever they're denied dexterity, right? Or you have combat advantage. Being invisible grants you grants it to you. CA until you shoot. So okay. if he doesn't come to face you... You basically get constant sneak attacks because you're you're shooting them from behind mm-hmm. um, until necess- he comes. Not necessarily. She'd have to flank him with Muga to, to get that. Not here. She's not flanking with anybody. She goes here. Here, I'm not flanking. 
but here I am. Be, you would not be flanking because nobody's standing here. So yes, that's flank. true. I guess I, so I, I well, and maybe I, so, I just don't know the rules of it. Standing there, there, there's no way the thing could get any type of dex, but it, it can't even look at her. Where? If it's standing in the corner here, if she's in the corner there, there's, I mean, I, I can't imagine it getting a dex it, bonus. It's not probably, flanking, but, I mean, I understand the rules, so to speak, that, you know, the flanking, but the, I, I can't imagine any creature being able to, to dodge someone without being able to see it. But and, and, she becomes visible the second she attacks it, right. and then he turns this full round of power on her. That's... Well, that's what you got to be worried of. That's right. the gamble. So, going here and attacking is the safe option. Going in here and attacking will risk turning, but, having this guy take a five-foot Time out. Um, then... By the way, Quadrule, uh, Coral... Yes, sir. Uh, ...healed you, so you are now at seven hit points as you come conscious. That's awesome. I don't have to stabilize or anything. No, you. Nope. Yep. You're good. Corral? I, I whisper to Corral, I'm like, I might get rid of Frank for this. <laughs> All right. So. <laughs> so okay, so uh, I have. Okay. I, I'm going to make my decision now based upon what Tangle would okay. logically do as well. Okay. And Tangle, to be honest, is still feeling rather uh, humbled by the fact that she ran ahead in the party. And so she's going to take the safe move. Sometimes she would have done this, depending on where her head is at, but her head right now dictates that she would do that. And I'm going to fire my uh, short bow. Oh, God. Yeah, that's a, that's a miss as... Um, uh, I'm, I'm not good with invisibility and stuff like that, but... It, it would still mess. It's under 10 regardless. So, yeah, I know, uh, but... Um, invisibility, I think you get a plus 2. No, I'm saying, like, <laughs> she's in the threatened area. Like, even though she's invisible, does oh, he get an opportunity attack reach? or not? Ugh. Yeah. I don't think he... I, uh, you're, you're, uh, you're game master here, but yeah, I, I don't I'm, think he could detect her. I like, don't think he could detect her. He, he could only smell her, and he had no idea that she was ready to shoot an arrow. It catches him unawares, but still misses, but she is now visible to him. Right okay. Here. So Bone just keep in mind is. that um, it looks like he has a longer reach than a medium creature. Right. Remember what happened when I started moving to super moving. Hulk Nuka. Come on, beastie. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so, Quadrule, you wake up. You are prone. I, uh, I'm going to drink my healing potion. Okay. As a, is that's a move action, right? Yeah. So I can do two move actions. Um, to drink it. What was it? Drinking stand. Stand. Yeah. Okay. Stand uh, I'll just do that. Uh, it's a one d eight potion. I think. One d eight plus one. Yep. One d eight plus one. Potion. Um. Yeah, it's a it's a move action to retrieve a stored item, and a standard action to drink a potion. So okay, I do that, and then I kind of uh, I take a five foot step right here, uh, so that I can let Roxas uh, get in there if he wants well, to. Well, you can't really do that because you already spent your move action. Okay, to that's fine. retrieve Whatever. a stored item, so you you just basically just heal up a little bit. Now it's okay. this guy's turn. He oh boy. <laughs> takes a five foot step back. I don't. Stands up on his hind legs, so to speak, and starts to yell loudly in some type of language that none of you understand. Is it scary? It's yes, abysmal. it's a very demonic sounding language. Super oh boy. Oh, um, and all of a sudden, he He's shifts coming. in and out of dimensions, so to speak. It looks like he's blinking. Very fast. <laughs> Sorry, you like you like my uh, little little uh, uh, descriptions just, of spell descriptions to give you a hint of what it is. Here, Kevin. I'm just well. I'm just worried where this is going. All right, so that's its turn. Is oh, it like this? Is, this is this is uh, attackable? She can still see his ugly head from here. Roxy's like. Guys, 
Uh, uh, <laughs> she she's like whatever magic missile. Okay. Yeah, oh, come on, that was a crappy magic missile. Six damage. Yeah, magic missile. Um. Hits. Okay. Do anyone have? No, I don't think any of your attacks are capable of striking ethereal creatures. Matt, any any magic weapon does. Any I mean, magic I've got weapon a... does? Fairly sure. I've uh, got... Every magic and, weapon and, is... And force damage, force damage does too. It's like magic missile. Okay, but I magic do... missile is automatically hit, so it doesn't matter for this. I can do key strikes, which count as magical damage, okay. and then I can do elemental fist, which is magical causing. My weapon's magic. All right, Muka. Yeah, but yeah. your elemental fist is elemental damage, technically. Okay. Like acid, fire, stuff like that. Okay. All right, well, I'm just going to go up here. I believe. Hey, that sounds right. Yeah. And, um, oh, and uh, before I officially end it, Roxy practices shouts to crawl. Be prepared to keep Mook on his feet. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, that's not awesome. <laughs> All right, that is a miss. Crawl. Moving in. Uh, shield other on Muka. I take half of his damage. I still, how much HP do you have, Cure All? What'd you put in it? Uh, I have 44. Nice. Alright, Tangle. Actually, um, you know what? I'm, oh, sorry. Can Carl. I... Can I switch it to there? I know I moved myself here. Uh, am I good to switch to there? With yeah, I know um, I... moving towards an enemy, uh, in, into a threatened area does not provoke an attack of off. No, I know. I'm, I'm thinking of uh, of our tiger friend and, and Muka. Oh, okay. Um, um, I want to stand back for right now. Okay. Uh, Absolutely. That's fine. Tangle. If I move here, um. Is there enough of a door lip here, like a door that I can hide behind for sneak attack? Um, is it, you know, not really? Or the thing it is, if you shoot open? from, if you move up and shoot, you will provoke an attack of off because you are inside of its threatened space. Okay, well then, I'm not doing that. Yeah, yeah thanks. That's all right. Oh, yeah, feeling demoralized. It's, it's all right. Everyone's feeling demoralized right now. Yeah, um, it's, not just I didn't even... it's not just Tangle. Um, <laughs> I, know, right? I rolled the worst possible thing I could on Magic Missile. Um, quadrule. <laughs> I know that my minute. He's, uh... <laughs> quadrule! What are you doing? Oh, you're, you're dead, Quadrule. <laughs> you died. That's horrible news. <laughs> I'm liver on your shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I guess Frank. I'm kind of wondering what the what options I have for healing further are to get Rock, back up to. Uh, Rock, you could but need to. Roxy has oh, a potion of cure. Modern, I have. So I actually have another one. I, I just oh, checked okay. my inventory. I have two, so I'm gonna do another healing potion. No, it's better than nothing, I guess. Um, and that's my turn. Man, it said dog's turn already again? That yeah. doesn't seem right. Are oh. you sure? <laughs> yeah. Everyone's been moving pretty fast, so... What about the tiger and, uh, Roxy? Uh, yeah, oh, the Roxas tiger didn't actually go, a, but... Roxas doesn't have, a natural magic weapons. He couldn't hit it. Well, if he charged in there, he'd provoke an attack of off, so... Okay. Right. Yeah, t um, Rox Roxas would be... It's kind of... Almost nullified right now because of no magic. Um, I can't like ride a tiger and get like super not a medium awesome tiger. <laughs> if you're medium size, you can't ride medium creatures. So if he enlarged the tiger, if he enlarged the tiger, he wouldn't be able to get in there anyways because of you guys. I'm just thinking awesomely. Um, I'm trying to find out <laughs> if magic items can strike ethereal creatures. They do. They do. They don't. They. They. The thing is though, they deal fifty percent damage. Okay. Uh, okay, so I, I I could be thinking of incorporal, but okay, so 
This guy wants to cast more spells, and you're all up in its grill, Nuka. I like it. He's very awesome, dude. I'm if very. He does I that. Love he this monster. It's my favorite off. one. Yeah. Maybe besides the one that backdoored us in that he dream camp. We will instead just go all out on your ass. Fuck yeah, bring it. <laughs> bite and two claws. Just she tries to bite your head off of this. Quadril shudders at the thought. Yeah. Hit. Um, no miss. Miss. And no. hit. They're all gonna hit. Oh, that's a one. Yep. Yeah, one miss. That's two. Um. Seven. Ooh, the monster's getting damage. all the good rolls. Except for the damage. Mm. So right. nineteen damage. Uh, seven nine, plus eleven. Eighteen. Is eighteen. 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 18. So you take nine damage. We okay. both take nine. Oh, okay. Thank you. Oh shit! Not not. Uh, you are at forty-four. Yeah. Minus nine. Not yeah, minus nine. nine. Not nine. Okay. There we go. Um. And it will. Uh, where will it five foot step to? It doesn't need to. It's happy. <laughs> it's not happy. <laughs> it's standing half on the fire. It's five foot steps there. Okay, Roxy, um, using her wand and not her regular attack, she fires the magic missile at it. One magic missile. Oh, crap. And with her with her move action, she gives you. She, she uh, tosses her potion of pure moderate wounds to uh, Quadrule. Okay. All right. And Roxas helps Quadrule to his feet. Okay. Um, Quadrule, nice. a tiger, picks you up by the cloak and uh, tries to nudge you up. And you are now Good boy, very Roxas. ungracefully standing up. <laughs> um, I think you have a potion. Take your moderate Nope. Luca. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Alright, well, I'm just gonna attack, unless you guys want me to move to the side, but that kind of lets the front gates open. I don't really want to do that on y'all. So, yeah? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Cool. Power attack. That's a miss. Damn. It's got a minus AC because it's large, right? It's already included. Oh. Alright. You know his AC is at least... Like, what? What? Every time you've hit it, it's been like 22 or 23-ish. Yeah. You know it's... It's it's around that. Mm -hmm. Might be lower, but it's at least 23. It's 20-something. It might be lower, but you don't know yet. Um, Corral. For all, you're a pretty decent attacker, man. I think you should, uh... I'm, I'm working on it. Yes. It's coming. I mean, oh. sorry. Oh, I still have my beer. Thank you for reminding me. <laughs> Grant us your aid. You're welcome. Aid. Plus one on attack rolls so and... So you casting uh, a spell? Yes, sir. Oh, oh shit. Uh, five foot step okay. back. Okay. Got about that I'll there. I'll allow it this once. Fair enough, fair enough. All right. Do do cleric spell? Yeah, I guess cleric spells do provo provoke an attack. Yeah, because of the semantic. All right, that makes sense. Uh, yeah. So everybody's gonna get. What are you defining? What? Uh, I'm casting eight. Okay. Uh, plus one on attack rolls, and the bonus hit points are not that great. Six. Right, so everyone gains six temporary hit points. Remember to put that in your little red circle thing. Mm -hmm. The red heartbeat. Or wherever you want to put it. Just don't add it to your current hit points. Tangle. Okay. Another short bow attempt. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Damn, three oh, ones in a row. Six oh. in this cloak. Jesus. God. What's wrong, yeah. Tangle? What's wrong? Oh, <laughs> I, I think she has to go to the bathroom and she's trying to hold it. She, and, she, was, not and, she was not expecting. She was not expecting this to happen. <laughs> uh, Quadrule, you have a potion of pure moderate wounds in your hands. One second, I need to look something up. There's gonna be a big fucking dog attacking. What's he changing into? A fucking freaking 
dragon? No, that's what he is. So what's he doing? You said he's all... Oh, he was just, like... He's just like shifting in and out, like, uh, mm -hmm. he's like a blinker. He, he's basically shifting between planes very fastly. That's... Where your, atta your attacks might miss. He's a... he's a... pain in the ass. Yeah, this is the real boss. I'm gonna skin this fucker. This is what, um, Nualia wanted to free, but was unable to figure it out, so... So he just walked... Wait, so she was unable to... Oh... Son of a bitch. I could have swore that... What was it, Matt, that my... It, it, Flurry of Blows, the base attack bonus is modified for every monk level, but there's one attack I have that the base attack bonus is equal to my my level. No, that's I'm trying to that, that's it. your Flurry of Blows, but we've discussed this. It's That's what the table is, because you're no, still I get taking that. a minus two. No, I get that. Yeah, I, I thought it was, it was something else, no, too, that, and I just haven't been modified. That's what it was. It's like at okay. level seven, it becomes equal to your normal. Your Flurry of Blows becomes equal to your normal, normal attack. And like level nine, it surpasses your normal attack. I'm just wondering if I should really use this, or if Mooka's going to be more useful than me. Mooka's up there single-handedly taking this thing out. Dude, you beat up the Walia. Get your up. Mooka is uh, like asking for help. Is what he's doing. So is it okay if I, can I? I'd like to move to here, and moving into threatened area does not provoke attack of op. It's moving out, right? Or oh I thought you shit. Said, look, that's not good. Don't say that. I'm sorry, dude. I'm not trying to. No, no, I wasn't even listening to you. Use that. Sorry, I was reading something. Oh, oh hey, uh, so you can still see invisible creatures, can't you, Roxy? I can. Okay, so you're fine. Everyone else is fucked. Great. I'm on candy dodge. Um, what? Sorry, my attack should have been higher. This is just gonna be great. Um, Fantastic. Zach, what were you saying? No right. Uh, Fucking hey, dude. Um, I want to move to here. And yeah, I made it. My guy, my guy makes a suggestion. What? Yeah, Gloria definitely. Gloria did not know how to get him out of the room. Get him out of the room? Uh, so you're saying we he step back? To him from that room. I think that's what she was. Uh, well, Matt, by looking at the size the of the monster and the size of this door, will the monster be able to chase us if we were to back off Mooka's and try and pick it off? He could squeeze through. Maybe, but he couldn't fit through. Yeah, I don't. Though. I don't think she would. I don't think she would. It was really easy to put two coins in here, walk up here, grab the key, and stick the key in. So he couldn't so, get past this point right, right here, right, Matt. Fucking a. Well, fucking he couldn't room. get open the doors because he's been locked in here for right. however oh, long. You don't know. Oh, right here. He couldn't open the doors. Okay. Well, he, he, he got in there, there somehow, the so hey. he could get out. Now he that the doors are open. Crap. All right. So what would you guys have? I mean, what I was thinking of doing was moving down to here, mm -hmm. and I already had this potion that he, she just gave me. Mm -hmm. And I would just drop it in Mooka's bag. Or, no, I, or you could walk up here and stuff it in his mouth. That's what I have one, and I can regenerate for 2D plus 4. So but I six. shouldn't worry about you then? Do not worry about me. Plus okay. I have half my damage halved, or at least... Yeah, how long his that damage lasts. is halved. Right, okay, so. I'm going to go ahead and... I'm gonna. It's okay with you if I heal up the next turn I come down there. I don't care. Because I... Seriously, at 19, she, I feel like she'll... That was plus, plus this this creature right now seems to um how's it look? Yeah. It seems it looks like a ghost right now, basically. You think okay, it could so we possibly can... actually move through walls. That's not right now. Alright, I'm fuck it. We but here, Matt, I just seriously, it, do I have anything Quadra would go attack a ghost if he knew his moves wouldn't work. Oh so you can spend what do I have your that key would work? points can make your attacks magical. Um, just throwing that out yeah. there. Yeah, let me look that up really quick, just to make sure. I, I know that it can, but I wonder if I have to do... No, I think it's just like, it makes your attack that you're using magical, which... So does it make all my flurry of blow yeah, strikes magical? basically. Okay, fine. Then I will, uh, I'm going to go ahead and I'll move down here. I'm going to... 
I mean, and someone on thing, YouTube might be like, you totally did that wrong. You suck as a GM, but I don't care. So, <laughs> someone's already messaged me that once. Seriously? Saying that, wow. yeah, they're, well, not that precise thing, but oh, they were okay. like, you can't flurry your blows more than one creature. And I was like, yes, you can. Yeah, yeah now, what a lot of people don't realize is that the rules are not rules. They're guidelines. Yeah, they're that's, guidelines. That's all they are. All right, so I move there. I use a key point to make my attack magical, and then I'm also going to do Elemental Fist to try and do some elemental damage to it. I'm going to choose uh, elect your electricity has been working, right, Mooka? Yeah. Well, okay, I'll do electricity. So you're spending a key point to make it magical, right? Uh, the a physical attack, yes, the physical part of that ele elemental fist. Okay. Yeah. So okay. All right. Here, here goes. Oh shit! Nope. Yep. Plus seven. Yep, so ten. Well, there we go. Crushed. Well, I mean, <laughs> you've technically plus rolled seven, a three, <sighs> and plus seven is ten. It's just, I mean, that's Matt's just such a nice guy. He's gonna let us. Hero point will get you over that, man. A hero point hero will point get you over that. I knew it would come to that. Fine. All right, I'll use a hero point to get my twenty. How many hero points do you have? Two, now I have one. Alright. So, um, roll again to confirm. Actually, <laughs> you, uh, actually, you spent the hero point, so that's automatically critical. Sweet. Okay. Um, alright. Plus. I'll do that from now on. If you roll a critical, you can spend a hero point to not Fuck confirm yes. it. To that's automatically a, confirm it. That's the 21 damage for the critical nice. strike. The key point, yep. and then here's a 1d6 electric three. All right, pretty good. I like it. It will. Oh, Do some wait. crazy! Shit. Even though it was a critical, it still hit because it was. There you go. Because uh, barrel. Yeah, um, because it's using blink, non-magical, anything that's. Because magical effect affects um, magical attacks normally hit ethereal creatures. Um, the mischance on a magical attack is only twenty percent, not fifty percent. Mm. So, right. all right, cool. Mouth, mouth. It will. Quadril's up here, but this is probably the most scared he's ever been in his life. He doesn't normally get scared. He's going to he full did, attack, Muka. Those are all hits. Of course, yeah, they are. <laughs> What's every? You got six points that. Well, well Muka looks at cure all. <laughs> <laughs> looks him in the eye. <laughs> uh, cure, cure all to out again. All could just like step back and blast them with uh, positive energy. Well, the only worry about that is that it's not an outsider. I don't, I don't want him oh, healing yeah. right now. See, th see, this is the 16, and this damage is what what I forgot earlier. But, but I'm only, now... they like, go within a certain radius? If you were to, like, stand here and channel out, when he only hit the, the front line or fairly angle? Large, I thought. Well, I the thing is, you can also channel, like, I only want to hit living humanoids. He's an outsider, can... you know? Oh, he so. is an outsider. But this is against Muka 15... Ooh. All right. Thirteen. Ah. Oh, God. Thirteen. Okay. Twenty-six. Thirty. Fifteen. So twenty-six plus fifteen. Yeah. And, and so Coral takes half of that. Luckily, thirteen plus thirteen plus fifteen is forty-one divided by two, is twenty point five round down. So every both of you take twenty damage. Remember, you get that six taken away right away. Yeah. So you're only really taking 14 hit points. What? Oh yeah, because that temporary thing. Because of aid. Good job. Um, and he this five is why foot... you need a cleric. They're awesome. He five foot yeah. steps there. Oh yay. He's done with you, Muka. Fantastic. I'm really excited <laughs> about that. Roxy. I fucking... She's best. like, she pets Roxy. I mean, you guys are actually doing pretty good. Well, especially... <laughs> Roxy, Roxy. That cleric, she you know. She pets Roxy and says... Oh. 
for if it was for a fire boy, but you'd be killed by that wild. thing. And she magic missiles his face. Ooh, oh. nice. Thank if God. only magic missile wasn't an automatic hit. God damn. Eleven damage. Yeah. I hate that rule so much. <laughs> I might have. It gets ridiculous at the higher end. I know too. it's so fucking dumb. Um, Level one spell. That's just the yeah. uh, Muka. Uh, so should I heal or should I attack? Heal. Oh, kill the thing! Kill the sucker! Go wrong! <laughs> I can just I can hero point and get another round. So it's, it's speaking common. You hey, fools cannot comprehend my knowledge and power. Go Rome! <laughs> hey, Matt, when he... I can keep doing this all day, ugly. All right, what's that? Yeah. We still, I can, still can't see him. I've never even seen what I'm punching. No, right? yeah, you can. He's visible. Okay, so how does he look right now? He looks like ugly. an ethereal <laughs> creature that's blinking very fast, like in and out of uh, this plane. Does he feel like he is he uh, on at least an inconvenience by our attempts to yeah, kill him? Yeah, he looks like he's inconvenienced. Okay, fantastic. That's better than nothing. So, all right, <laughs> <It's laughs> inconvenience. All right, um, I'm eleven. All right, you son of a bitch. Um, right. I'm gonna <laughs> hero point. Okay, so another turn. Nice. So you get a standard action. Yeah, um, I'm gonna take him. Okay. Let me just up arrow a bunch of times. I guess I'll do this right here. Alright. Let me roll <laughs> my... That is a hit. Alright. All right. Power attack, so... Oh, wait, it's... Tri okay, no. You're good. You're good. Sorry. Is that right? All right. I was, I was looking... I was seeing what bull's strength does. That's That's... I keep reading that strength, not dexterity. Cat's grace is dexterity. So it doesn't increase his AC, unfortunately. So, power attack got ridiculous at this level, so... Anyway. Yay! 27. 27? Damage? Nice. Alright. Plus 16, down power attack. Alright. You, um... You drink your potion. Your muscles bulge out. I didn't drink potion, I... What'd you do? How'd you heal? The rage, rage power. power. Oh, okay, nice. Your barbarian rage powers granted <laughs> to you from a troubled childhood. Um, <laughs> make your muscles bulge out and you seem reinvigorated. You point at the monster and then you slam your great axe into its neck as you can't really reach its head to, unless you're jumping. Mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. you cut into its throat, and its blood spills out, ex extinguishing the fire below, and covering you and Quadrule in its bloody mess as it falls down to the ground. Nice. And this ah. is, that's basically what the creature looked like, just in case you guys want. That's pretty sweet. 